Hello again! As you might already know, workflows are a great way of involving the right people at the right time and keeping people informed of what is going on with the document. This time, we'll be taking a look at how to send notifications through a workflow. In this case, the send notification action could be applied, for example, to the final workflow state, to send an email to the document creator once the document is approved. Also, we want to dynamically notify the exact user who has moved the document into the draft state, in this example, the creator. This can easily be done by selecting the user from the state transition. Here, you can add the subject and the message for your notification to help the recipient understand what has happened with the documents. You can also add placeholders in the subject and the message fields. These placeholders will pick up the chosen metadata from the document and add them in the notification. Let's open the desktop to see how this works. Oh, in case you're wondering about the assignments included in this workflow, don't worry, we have a video that covers them. Assignments themselves send an automatic notification, but usually workflows with assignments also have separate notifications, for example, when the document gets approved or rejects it. You could also create another state that sends a message to the document creator and moves the document back to the draft state if the document gets rejected. In order for this to work, you need to add some triggers to the state transitions. One that automatically moves the document to the rejected state and one that moves it directly back to the draft state. This is related to the assignment that has been defined in this workflow. This is a great way of keeping people up to date of what is going on with the documents they put into a workflow. So don't forget to tell your colleagues about it, as well as the importance of workflows. If you want to learn what else you can do with M-Files, make sure to check the other videos as well. I'll see you there.